today is October 25th and our 34 year old patient just had lower eyelid and fat transfer to the face done on October the 18th. Today is exactly one week post-op. Uh, the patient's main concern before the surgery, if you can zoom me on this photo, is the hollowness on the temple area on the two sides of her face and also her prominent cheekbone. So Dr. Ken, with her own fat, he transferred the fat to the temple area and also the area around the cheek so the cheek is not as prominent. He also put the fat on the nose and also the chin to lengthen the whole face. So with the fat done, her face now looks more vertical and smaller. And she also looks younger with the fat in. And the lower eyelid, um, you can really see her lower eyelid, this photo actually too. She had the fat back under the eyes. With the fat back taken out, you can see her muscle much more prominent. And she now looks no longer tired, and she just looks more younger and more energetic. Um, so Miss Liu, how do you feel? It's good. It's good? Yeah. And what do you think of the surgery? Um, the whole surgery has been very fast. Mm -hmm. And I didn't suffer. And yeah, and the pain good. was very minimal. Yeah. Now, today was also only one week, but as you can see, she's not as swollen. Um, the bruising is pretty minimal too. Uh, the lower eyelid was done with a no-touch technique. So basically, Dr. Ken did the whole lower eyelid surgery on the inside. So there was no suture at all outside. Um, so when do you went back to work? Um, after two days. So on the third day, she went back mm -hmm. to work. And the swollenness was pretty, probably went down after the first two days, right? Yeah. So fast recovery and no suture needed to be removed on the lower eyelid part. And how do you like the result? Perfect. It's so perfect, far, it's right? Good. Yeah. It's good, right? Yeah. And it's only one week. And it's going to be better as time go goes. Mm -hmm. uh, with the fat put in, her skin will also be more hydrated for the winter. So you will see yourself using less cream this winter, but it will still be really hydrated. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you.